Have you ever wondered what happens on site when the soil that you're building on is too soft? Well, one of the options is you drive piles. So we smash the piles down until we hit good ground. We started off by driving a pile in each corner of the section. You want to be making sure your piles are long enough. Timber piles, there's going to be 72 under this slab here on the townhouse job. Building two townhouses here side by side with a firewall in the middle. When I first started my apprenticeship and we were digging for a foundation, you'd dig down until the dirt was solid and then you'd call that good ground and you'd carry on. These days you have to get an engineer in for a soil report. The engineer will use a pentrometer, does a series of blows and tells you where good ground is. On this job here, good ground, was 3.1 meters down. So what do you do when that's the case? So imagine this was your house here and we would put a concrete foundation under it and good ground would normally be 300 to 600 mils away. But in this instance here, good ground is over three meters away from the floor. So what do you do in that instance? you drive a bunch of timber piles under the foundation all the way down to the good ground or rock at the bottom and what happens is the timber piles transfer the load up here all the way down to here. So what do you do when that's the case? You end up with 72 driven piles. And like you saw in the video before, the pile driver drives them until basically they stop moving. And then we cut them all to height and then we build our house on top of that. The boys are going to come in tomorrow and chop all of the piles to height. This timber here on the edge of our property is the finished floor height. And we will cut the piles, I think it is 320 mils below floor level. Uh, we'll work that out tomorrow, I'll make sure that's correct. But we cut that below, it goes to the same height as the binding sand. Then we put our DPM on, then we put on our pods and our steel and our concrete. Keep watching to find out what's happening.